Our opening story tonight, explosions heard overhead overnight as the IDF responding to an attack from our northern neighbors in Syria. ILTV's Marnie Shamroth reporting. Northern Israeli towns waking to warning sirens early Wednesday morning. This as an anti-aircraft missile fired from Syria exploding over Umm al-Fam and nearby communities. Syrian sources reporting that the attack was retaliation for alleged Israeli airstrikes near Damascus earlier this month. But in any case, Israeli residents reporting a loud bang from above and shrapnel later falling near the Chomish outpost, sparking a small fire. But thankfully, there are no reports of casualties. And in fact, the IDF even saying that there was no need for interception as the ordinance exploded on its own. Regardless of how successful the attack was, however, the launch begging a response from the Israeli military. Israeli authorities consistently vowing to protect the country from any challenges to its sovereignty. So the IDF acknowledging the targeting of several Syrian air defense units, including radar and anti-aircraft batteries that launched missiles at IAF aircraft. And Syrian media reporting the attack as coming in two waves. First, Israeli jets firing a missile barrage from within Lebanon, and second, another barrage of surface-to-surface -surface rockets allegedly fired from the Israeli Golan Heights towards Damascus. One Syrian soldier said killed and five more wounded in the strikes. ILTV Plus, your news from Israel and more 24-7. Start your free trial today. Subscribe at ILTV.TV and watch from any device.